Some guy named friend. How's it going, everybody? I am some guy named Nate, and we are playing ARMS today, as we are every day until it's over with. And we are playing Bite and Bark today. Look at your doggo friend. Here we go. Look at, let's see how much the Bite and Bark actually weigh. Are they going to say it, like, separate? Like, it's going to be like, this is what bar Bite weighs. This is what Bark weighs. Is that how it's going to be? And uh, no, 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 it's supposed to be. Mmm, it's how it's supposed to be. And the girls in the club like pose for me. Come out with your hands up because you're tuned into arms. I'm Biff. I like how it's slightly different depending on what character you chose. I'm Biff, and I'll be your commentator as always. So, height 186 centimeters, weight 120. He's the model K9000. His hobbies are avoiding salt water and fetching. Oh, he's on the beach patrol. That makes sense. So, he's a beach crime fighting robot. They've been on duty for a while now, but they're eager to, eager to get back into their love of fighting. Killing things. Besides, salt water is bad for their circuits. Alright, the Arms Grand Prix is about to start. Ah! A Robocop. Be in a Robo Schmop. Grab a Robo Mop. Because I'm Robocop. Getting Kid Cobra out of the way right off the gate. Huzzah. Match one is a go go. I am a robot. By Bombard, turns out Kid Cobra had a run-in with the Beach Patrol before, when he was skateboarding and I tackled him. Can they lay down the law and show him who's in charge? Pow, 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 pow. Okay, we're going to do... I don't like... Okay, I'll do the Sea Key and the Bob. There you go. No, wait. Crap. There you go. There you go. I guess that also cycles your shit. There you go. Okay, okay, okay. Don't punch me. No. There you go. Dude, the dog is so helpful. It'll, he only does 20 shits, but he's helpful. There you go. There you go. Get out of here. Pow. He's got robo-punched. How does it feel, bitch? He's got robo-bitched. How does it feel, punch? Oh, man. Dude, Bark is being a little... There you go. Dude, nice. There's left hooks. That's all you need is left hook after left hook. Oh, man. There you go. Bring it in hot. Pow. Nice, good job. Robo team is a dream team. Don't you scream, we're the dream team. Pow. Down goes Kid Cobra with a big punch to the face, Magoo. And I'm sticking with this combo. Oh, dude. Dude, that's a good combo. Yeah, I can fight grab with grab, bitch. So, guys, if I don't talk that much during the arms playthrough, I'm sorry. I need to get better at solo commentary. I wish all my things were co-op commentary, though. That would be awesome. Come on, bitch. No! I wanted a flawless victory against Kid Cobra. Like that's gonna happen. Punch. What a load of course. Fuck you! Does the dog get on top of me when... Yeah, he does. The dog gets on top of me when we do the special. Bam! Look at, look at, look at Doggo Friend. He won. Good job, Doggo Friend. Doggo Friend saves the day. He says, okay. I like the background, too, of the Beach Patrol. It looks like a Mexican city. So does that mean I'm a Mexican robot? Hooray, we're the best of best friends in the universe. Because I don't know you. That's my purse. I can make combo references if I want. It's my damn show. I don't... Okay, guys. It's going to be really hard to do the rest of my recording stuff today because I have to record a fuckload today. And then Sunday, I need to look at my schedule, but it should be fine. Uh, it's Bite and Bark versus the Eris Ribbon Girl. I still have to record my thousandth video special. This will be up, by, or that'll be up by the time this goes up. But I don't know what I'm recording. That's the problem because I've, I've already tried like a few things, and none of those are working. There you go. Fuck you. I've also got a doggo, and I've got a doggo. I can I can jump on my doggo, and do a super jump. I like that. I don't know why I would do that. Oh, man. Did my doggo just save me from that grab? I think he did. That was awesome. How? Come on. Oh, yeah. Another grab. Pow. Dude, this is great. God. Damn it. I wanted to fucking... I wanted to do a Seeky. Dude, at least my dog can absorb a punch for me. That's always good. Damn it. There you go. So that means technically Bite and Bark has three fists. So that's cool. And down goes Ribbon Girl. Huzzah. Robocop Patrol. Execute. Uh, winning a game show and beating all these humans. Bleep bloop. I am a powerful robot. Look at me go. I know everything about the show Friends. Ross Geller is a big man slut. 
Beep boop. I won at the friends competition when I answered all the friends questions correctly. Nice. Dude, my doggo is saving me from all these grabs. It's great. Come on. Oh my god. Come on, doggo. Doggo punch. One punch. Nice. Dude, the, the freaking Siki is like great. There you go. And because fuck you, we're just gonna do this. Yeah, he just exploded there. I'm so sorry. That's cool though. I like how I have a dog head when I'm in special mode because Bark jumps on my head. That's actually really cute. Look at that. My doggo friend is my best friend too. I'm actually liking, liking Bite and Bark a little bit more now. I still hate the other two morons. But we'll play as them later. Yay, target practice. Who are we punching? I hate this guy so much. Helix is so shitty. I don't think any of his arms are really good on target practice. So blah, blah, blah. I've got targets. Let's just do the two standard arms. Oh, he slowly brought his shield at me. Wow. Fuck you and your shield. His shield is so stupid. Like, that's probably the worst arm in the whole game. You know, I'm brutally honest here, and I am. There you go, I punched Helix because he fucking deserves it. Fuck you again, Helix. Well, I'm still winning. Wow, he got way too many points there. Come on. Can my doggo fucking get some points, please? Thank you. Yeah, get out of here. Nice. There you go. Fuck you. There you go, my doggo. And an extra flip, because fuck you. Good job. My doggo helped me there. Did you see that? And my doggo punched him right there, and then I grabbed him when he was stunned, even though the clock ended. That was great. Good job, Helix. Dun dun dun. Bite and Bark are winners. Hooray! Robo Doggo destroyed your fucking Flago. Good job. This, man, this match is going by really fast. Good, because I still have yet to record my other thing. You know what I'm saying, guys? Pow, pow, pow. Match four. Sniff them out. It's Bite and Bark versus Master Mummy. Ah, Purple Hulk and the gnarled trees around the ring make it seem like nobody has been here for a while. And the center looks like I might cave in the grim place. It might be. It gives me the creeps. Ah. All right, let's stick with the this combo again. This works for me in the past, and it will work for me in the now. Let's go back, back to the past to play these shitty games of suckers. Yes, dude, this is such a good combo. This, this two combo of two arms is so unfair. Like, I can just keep doing this, just charge it up, punch him, double punch him, jump back, jump back again, punch him again, jump back, jump on my doggo, punch him again, blow him up. Because that went through his fucking shield, too. Dude, this combo is exceptional. I'm starting to like bite and bark a lot more. Again, he just keeps going up on my cool dude chart. Look at that shit. I might do the higher difficulties of bite and bark then. I don't know. You guys will find out. Tell me what you guys want me to do the higher difficulty bonus episode with. If it's bite and bark, sure, because I'm starting to like him. Look at him. Oh, man. Let's grab him, because fuck you. How? Yes! Combo that shit. Nice. Double perfect against Master Shmummy. Good job, Nato Potato. Holy fuckle. So if you guys don't know, uh, I've, I'm finaleing a lot of things really soon. So I hope you guys are enjoying all those and all the new content I'm going to bring. That's the problem, guys. When you play a Let's Play for too long, you're like, wow, this fucking sucks. And then when you... I love Mechanica. She's cool. Um, and um, when you play a game for too long... Like, it'll hit a peak point when you're like, God, I hate this game. And then if you play it for slightly longer than that, then you'll be like, I like how my missiles even have eyeballs. They're like, what the hell's going on, boss? See that? My eyes are moving. What the hell? But yeah, um, fucking, uh, I'm almost done with Dang Rampa, and I'm almost done with, um, this, and I'm all, uh, I've recorded the last of the Grand Theft Auto, so Yeti and I are done with that shit. So lots of, and uh, Vince and I are done with Overcooked, and Travis is too, I wouldn't count Travis. I don't know, Travis has become a thorn in my butt. I mean, making content is not that hard. 
Let's be honest here. But Travis makes it seem like it's just gonna kill all of his free time. You know, damn it. How dare you punch my dog. God. Have a Seeky. Oh my god. Here you go. Come on. And grab to finish off Mechanica. Good job. Good job by Untbark. Beating up a little girl. I mean, they were kind of told to, because you know you're in a robot. You're in a fighting league. You're told to beat up the other person. So... Also, guys, again, when you unlock more arms, you can set arms in, like, the menu when you're selecting your character. So, that's a thing. No, I forgot she has missiles, too. The piece, hers have a burn buff to them, not a stun buff to them. You know, like that. Which does a lot more damage, I think, is the stun buff. Yeah, good job, doggo. Good job. Fuck you! Nice! Last punch does it. Nice. Good job, Bite and Bark. Look at that shit. Robocop saves the day by punching you in the boot, hey? I like how the fans of Bite and Bark and the audience have giant bark heads. It's adorable. I would buy a giant bark head. Look at that. Next. Wonder what's next. I wonder who's next. Volleyball against Twintel, that's what I'm guessing. No, it's Ninjara. I want to do basketball again. It never does basketball. And I was blah, blah, volleyball, blah blah blah. I'm actually gonna stick with these arms. This will actually save me in the long run, I think. Yeah, fuck you. We gonna do slut? There you go. Good job. My dog helped, dude. My dog is MVP. Everyone should have a dog. Everyone should have a robot dog to tell them what to do. God, get over there. No! Fine. Yeah, fuck you! So you get for getting a point on me. Nice! Nice! I'm just gonna do that again, right off the bat. Yeah! And spike that shit. Yeah, my doggo helped! Woo! My doggo was a good help right there. Look at that, look at that spike into missile. And down it goes. My dog pretty much punched the net, but he helped anyway. He's a good doggo. Give him some robo treats. What do robots dogs eat? Ro what do robot dogs eat, everybody? Tell me that common question of the day. What do robot dogs eat in their spare time? Are they like robo kibble? It's Min Min. Yay! Gal pals for life. And totally gonna be my wife. But not wife to a robot guy. That's creepy. You can't f robots. Well, maybe in the future. In the near future. You will be able to have intercourse with robots. And in that, you will be able to make your robots look however you want, even like Morgan Freeman. Oh my god! Also, guys, my Morgan Freeman impersonation is getting better. I'm trying. Come on, Min Min. There you go, my dog saved the day. Oh man! And again, Min Min's a lightweight, so. Oh god. Come on, doggo, you should have saved me. Doggo! Come on. There you go. Bap. Get in the health pool, bitch. Yes. Stay out of my health pool. Oh my god. There you go. Bap. Oh man, she's still alive. I thought she was done. Oh no. No, I wanted a flawless victory against my noodle friends. There you go. Second homie arm took her out. Good job. Bite und bark. I think Bark is a lot cooler than I at first thought he was. I mean, look at that Robo Dog. Dogging it up. There you go, you can't double avoid that bitch. Oh man. Maybe you can. Doggo, you missed. My doggo keeps missing. Punch. I like her village though, her village is cool. Oh no, my dog! My dog exploded! There you go. I've got a full power meter too, so I can probably use that any second now. Ooh. <laughs> oh man. Good job, squad. The job squad. Blam. Three blue explosions. 
She's still alive, though. She only got slightly burned. Poo! Look at my robo-dick. Hooray! Good job. Good job, team. Go, team, go. You don't know. Where's Twin Twelve? I think this is Twin Twelve, yeah? No, it was Springman. Springman. Hooray! So that means it's just Springman, Twin Twelve, and uh, Max Brass then. Yeah, I know. We're Spring people. Sticking with this. <laughs> Opening move! Fuck you! Let me move a second time. Oh no! Oh god! Oh, there you go. Bounce on those walls, bitch. No! Oh crap, my dog just made a recoil attack. He's like, oh, you ever punch him, my friend? Oh man. Dude, I told you the strategy is where it's at. And get out of here. Thank you. And fuck you! <laughs> Dude, that is so satisfying. His missile-y, like, finisher right there. Look at that. The missile hits him and then it blows up. That would suck. I mean, if you got killed by the explosion of a missile, that would suck. But if you got killed by the impact of the missile hitting you in before the explosion, that would double suck. You wouldn't even get to fucking enjoy the fucking, you know, explosion. You'd have to be in pain for a little bit. Oh, man. Sorry, bite wound bark. I'm sorry. I am oh no god oh god the robo pain that hurt Mario Rabbids and Minions in one game why is he so charged up right now there you go did he just say woohoo oh no he countered my grab with a grab no I might actually lose one guys there you go I think I might be able to defeat him still there you go, and guess what? Fuck you! Ugh, there you go. You just have to time your specials at the right time, and then you're good. Blam, blam, blam. Blue explosion. What's the deal with these Flanchingtons? Good job. Man, I might get a lot more than 40 for this match. I don't know. Who knows? Okay, Twintel, you and me are going on a date. You. Look at her. Look at her earrings, too. I didn't even notice her earrings. Look at those. Do, do, do. Match 9, take them down. It's Bite and Bark versus the Silver Screen Queen Twintel. Cool, cool. Not sure if robots even know what hair is, so this could be trouble. <laughs> they might be programmed to know what hair is. Keep your mechanical wits about you, boys. Okay, here we go. Pow. Opening move. Oh, crap. Oh, no, she got the twirlies. She's got a chiller and the twirlies. Pew. Okay, so far, so bad. My stupid robot senses are failing me. I am attracted to your not robo booty. I'm into robo booty myself. Get here. Pow. That was nice. There you go. And another one. Pow. This is great. Oh, wait, crap. Oh, crap. I, I jumped into the bomb. Crap. My dog blew up. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yes, there you go. Oh god, no! She grabbed me again. Her sass slap took me down. Good job, doggo. No! Damn it! Almost down to one health bar. There you go. My doggo also helped, kind of, and is now making dents on your roof. What do you think of that? Oh man, okay, zoom in on the booty. Okay, good. That's what I wanted. I just wanted to zoom in on the booty. Wasn't able to do that for a couple of parts. Ow! Why does she not have her standard arms? Those are the only good ones. Come on. Oh god, wow! When she powers up her umbrellas, though, they're really powerful. You know, I didn't even use it, but it seems to me like that it works. You know? Wow, nice. And pow, get out of here. Get out of here, Twin Tail. There you go, get out of here again! <laughs> Dude, that would suck. If you flew that far, you would be down for the count. Get out of here, Twindell. Get out of here. Oh, God. I might be dead. I might be dead. I might be dead. Okay, good. We're fine. There you go. One homie missile to the face hole, and she's down. Old. Salute, damn it. Right in the kneecap. Aw, oh, booty. Oh, but it's out of the camera range. That's fine. Good job, Robo Squad. Robo Squad presents Robo Battle 8000. And now we're going to beat up Max Brass again. Or maybe it makes me go against Headlock if I do good enough. Nope, it's Max Brass. 
It's going to scare me when it finally chooses headlock for me to go against, because that guy is fucking terrifying. Oh, God. Oh, I don't care. Stick with the homie in the fist. I might do a double homie for the second round. I don't know. Oh, God. Nice hammer strike, bitch. And you punched my dog. How dare you? I like how I got a double flawless against this moron with Twintel, though. I mean, did I? You guys should watch that last part again and tell me if I did good. Get back here, you fucker. Oh, good job. My doggo saved me. Come on. Oh, man, I missed. Dude, there's a lot of missing going on. Damn it. So we're still in round one of this shit? Oh, my God. There you go. Punched. Okay, he's still alive, hardly. Damn it. So am I. Come on, doggo, save the day. Oh, doggo, save me. There you go. This will, this will finish it. I think he should fly off the arena. That'd be so fucking funny. My doggo was pushing me there. Good job, doggo. See, doggo was pushing. What a pushy doggo. Hooray. Let's do double homies. There you go. Pow. Come on, double homies, save me. Come on. There you go. Damn it. Come on. Dude, the homies are so unfair. You can just be super unfair with this shit. Oh my god. There you go. Nice. Nice juggle, Nate. Oh my god. Fucker's laughing at me like an animal. Damn it. Good job, Animu. No! This might actually be my first loss with Max Brass here. There you go. Fuck you times two. Getting some health back. Every day I bounce back. Go to LAX and bounce back. You guys know how to bounce back. No! There you go. And take you down. There you go. Doggo and Robot save the day. Good job, Doggo Robot Squad. Doggo Robot Squad. Pow! Right in the face. Ah! Oh. I thought I was going to be funny, and I wasn't. Double missiles. Pling! Good job. Good job, Bite Wunt Bark. You are the champ. You've got a stamp collection at your house, and you're the champ. Look alive. Award ceremony is about to begin. You're on easy difficulty, but who cares? Look at how good you fucking did. You got a double flawless victory against Master Mummy. That was awesome. I thought that was a splendiferous thing. Good job. Score worth celebrating, Biff. I don't believe you. I don't believe any word you're saying, Biff. You know? Pow, get ready to go crazy. Bite and bark one. Are they going to have to share the belt? Nope, they're wearing it like normal. The clockwork cops bite and bark. Look at him. How is it able to twirl when he's bending his arm? He graduated from Beach Patrol to Arms Champs. Congrats. And another Arms Grand Prix draws to a close. Good job, everybody. Ah! <laughs> That's how I should end all conversations. Well, that was a fun laugh riot, and there's just two episodes left, you guys. I hope you guys enjoy the last two parts of Arms. Thank you guys so much for watching this part. I will see you in part, I think, 10 of Arms. Thank you guys so much for watching this shit. I will see you in the next one. Bye.